Hello everybody, this is Halo Avenger Productions. Uh, it's Bumpery here, playing um, Medieval Total War. I'm not, no, not Medieval Total War. Uh, Harrison, cut that. <laughs> playing Medieval Warfare. Medi Chivalry and Medieval Warfare. This is a game where it's basically a giant medieval deathmatch. Um, let's see. And along with that, there's a bunch of different classes. One being the archer, which I have just chosen. Oh, and right here there's a small little five second piece of time before everything starts. So you can basically team kill. Actually, never mind. Wow, that wasn't the time. Never mind. Everyone kills each other. And that's a fun time. The classes are archer, which... It's kind of obvious. Well, one thing that might not be obvious is the fact that you can get a javelin in this, which is one of the alternative, alter, alternative, um, ranged weapons, along with the bow and the crossbow, which I think are pretty good weapons. There's the vanguard, who is long, me, long range melee, which means like spears, swords, and halberds. There is the knight who is heavily armored and has an option of using a war hammer, a war axe, or a broadsword. Let's check. Actually, a long sword, same thing. And the last one would be man at arms, who has similar weapons to the uh, vanguard, and uh, I would think he has similar weapons to the vanguard and the archer, except he has a shield. And he's a fairly light trooper, so it's fairly easy to kill him. The, there are the two teams. The blue guys, which are the Agatha Knights. And the red guys, which are the Mason Order. The Mason, the Mason Order are the bad guys, basically. Um, the description is they want to destroy all the evil. In, all They want to destroy all that is good in the world. And sorry for my bad gameplay. Guys, I'm really not that great at this game. Oh, God. Man at arms. See, this is the man at arms. See, as you can see, he has similar weapons. Actually, not just the two glasses. He has similar weapons to all of them. And he's pretty fun to play. Considering as a shield, it makes, him easy, makes it easier to block arrows, swords, axes, anything they try to stab you with or hack at you with. You do a lot of the attacks by with the scroll wheel on your mouth. Mouse. Why did I say mouth? Um, yeah. With the, on the mouse. The largest games I've seen are up to 64 players. Which can be quite a good time. Compared to many things like console games which have like... Or even PC games which sometimes have like 16, 32 people. Depends. Overall, this is just a very good game. I am just going to show you um, a little while of me playing this game. May or may not be epically failing, but that's besides the point. Dun -dun 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 -dun. No, that was an epic fail. Um, good, I killed that guy. For a second, I thought I just took out my buddy. No, blocking does not work like that. Damn it. Uh, as you see, I'm using the Warhammer here. It is actually a quite fun weapon to use, considering whenever you use it properly, their head just goes flying off. <coughs> and that is a good example, even though it was with a sword. Just think of it like one hit doing that. And excuse me if there's anything wrong with my mic, because sometimes it makes these demony noises. I need to get a new mic. And excuse me if the audio um is kind of messed up, because it's my first time recording. I haven't recorded ever before. So, basically my first time. Come on. And, girl, no. And, 
I'm kerplunk. Come on. Stop blocking me, bitch. No. Come on, shield, why, why don't you work, okay? So yeah, this is my second time recording this because there was something wrong with the FPS last time. And the audio was kind of messed up. I, mean, I can't send it to Sam like that. Because that just wouldn't be very good. Oh god. Okay, something that's bad about this game is... Well, one thing that's bad... Well, it's meant to be realistic. The fact that there's friendly fire. So if everyone's in a big fight with their weapons, pretty much... Like, if everyone's in a big axe fight, for example... And you're still swinging, even though the enemy's dead... Because sometimes, like, someone else kills them first... You know, your friend's axe can kind of go into your face... Okay, that is a cool weapon. It's like a fork. Except with two prongs. I feel kind of awkward doing this. It's like talking to myself. Except hopefully people will watch it. No. I call hacks. And some of the neat weapons in this game, personally my favorite, I like the hand axe that you can use with Vanguard. It's actually a very good weapon. And this game, sometimes I feel like you can get pretty much get the better game if your computer's better. Like, like some games aren't like that, where it doesn't matter how good your computer is. But some, like this game, it's pretty much the fastest computer wins, in my opinion, sometimes. Okay, that sounded very confusing. No, that was bad. <laughs> so, yeah. And if you have any suggestions of what we should play next, then I, you could put it in the comment section below. And... So yeah, this is pretty much the end of my first video. Have a nice day. Hey guys, it's just Halo Avenger. And we just did something really stupid. Yeah, well, off. we recorded the second half too, like a few minutes ago, but Samuel...